Jackson's back like they were like as if they were gargoyling on the end table and they were like looking back and it like for that tenth of a second until I realized it was a vase. God. So what if the guy's a little nuts? He's a director. It comes with a job. I mean, what's he gonna do? Kill ya? What's he gonna fucking do? Kill ya? Uh if the director doesn't then Alec Baldwin will. <laughs> Get me the fuck out of there. She wants her t Oh my god. That's, that's what friends are for. We're all friendly here. That original thing done. Oh my god! I'm gonna go this way. Okay. Oh, fuck. I feel like I'm in sixth grade and afraid to fucking phone call women now. Oh my god, that was terrifying. Seduces me. Gotta be something around here then. Oh! Okay, I didn't see this before. My bad. I swear to fuck, if you assholes start moving on me. Like, I don't want to pull this out, because I feel like that's supposed to go in there. Hmm. So, I don't really know what- oh, it opens the doors, okay. Yeah, it's one of those. It's... <laughs> oh, fuck! Oh, my fucking God, that destroyed. What the fuck, tree? The button. It's... Oh, you fucking prick. Oh, God. Just consistently hovering in my right ear. Light in the darkness. There's always a way. All right, all right, all right, you're right. Let me, here's the way out, right? No? Do you remember? Do you remember? You remember, no worries. Whoa! Told you Fuck! You be. Steal yourself. Be your heart soaked in doubt, or be there a fire burning within. Okay. With this, a key. 
Probably for that. Oh, what's this? No, it's why is there a random chalice here? Oh, fucking shit! Leave me alone! Oh no! Ooh, gotcha, bitch! Oh god! Oh no! <laughs> oh, oh, that was some tea, a bottle of something, and a b another bottle of maybe some water. Although it's a nice glass, who knows? Not too shabby. It's locked. Okay. What's this? Oh, fuck me! Jesus! Oh my... Why did I just fall for that? I just don't understand where this thing's supposed to fucking go. You would think it would go around that spot, but it's not. Like, look. That's right where it needs to be. You can't fucking tell me no to that. Oh, fuck! I fucking hate this. I can't go back there now. Okay. I took a fish head out to see a movie. Didn't have to pay to get it in fish heads, fish heads. Roly poly fish heads, fish heads, fish heads. Eat them up, yum, they can't play baseball. They what don't the wear fuck? sweaters. They're not good dancers. They don't play drums, fish heads, fish heads. Roly poly fish heads. Fish heads, fish heads, eat them up, yum, roly poly fish heads are never seen drinking cappuccino oh, in Italian fuck. restaurants with oriental women. By a copperhead, heavy, oh, and, no. I, and I had to, heavy, I, when she got bit by that copperhead, I had to leave my Yu-Gi-Oh tournament. I had to oh, leave no. my, so I could rush her to the hospital, but it was too late, heavy. She, she, done, How many, she did die. She done did die. How many pots of greed didn't get played because your sister died? Oh, my whole deck is pot of greed. <laughs> <laughs> they say that's illegal. They say you can't have that for a tournament. I show them a different deck, and then right at the last minute, I swap them out for my pot of greed deck. The last time I showed some of my deck, I got yelled at. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, they'll do that, too. You, they'll yell at you you show them a deck full of pot of greed. That's why you got to hide it from them, because you, you show them one pot of greed, and they're like, all right, that's you're one of them. And then you, you play it, you show a second pot of greed. They're like, okay, I think you can only have one of those. Then you show them 30 <laughs> pots of greed. And they're like, you don't have a single monster in this deck or a spell or a trap. I'm like, I don't know what none of that is. I got a pot of greed. And it's pot of greed always wins. I think we made it. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, 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 oh. Hey. Thank fuck. Maka. <laughs> he is. Look. Pleased to meet you. Won't you guess my name? Boo boo. What the fuck? What the fuck? What, of all times, a game to get choppy. Go stop. Fuck. How dare. Now the game's like smooth as fuck. Like, okay, that was mean. Fuck. The door slam at the end, I forgot about that. Hello everybody, welcome in. Uh, what day of the week is it? Thursday. Happy Thursday, everybody. God, I am on my own fucking level at some points of the day. Uh... I hope you all have had a lovely week so far. We are in Thursday night, a.k.a. pre-Friday. Uh, I actually found out today that um, I don't have to cover Juneteenth on Monday, so I have a three-day weekend. I'm down with that. Uh, so that was a, a pretty good little boost to the day today. Um, I actually uh, traded some emails earlier. Um 
with some PR from uh, representing Frictional Games, who do, who do the Amnesia series. Uh, they were curious about um, when we could be doing the bunker, because obviously the game has now been out for like two weeks. Um, and of course, I mentioned like, well, I, I'm actually going to be playing Rebirth first. <laughs> so I'm sure it's not a huge deal. What show we going to? Yes. What's up, buddy? Here for the lurk. Going to bed. Enjoy your stream. Broke our week up early. Oh, that's gross. Well, thank you for the lurk either way, Mr. Hell. Yeah, I appreciate you, dude. Hope all is well. Polish. I don't know if there's any shows this weekend that I know of. But um, Metal Fest tickets go on sale tomorrow. I'm definitely going to buy myself one. Seems like a lot of people I know were, were pulling to go to Saturday. Um, I do like Parkway Drive. I just... Don't feel like I want to drive out to Worcester to catch them. <laughs> Neither the pit, man. It's like crack. Yeah, once once you break that, it's like breaking the seal when you're drinking, man. You do it once, and you're just like, oh my god. After review, Saturday is it? I've already seen them live. Oh, okay. I've I've yet to see them live. I'm assuming they're good though. Um, but yeah, their early stuff was really fucking heavy. Um. I was very impressed. Like, I remember someone showed them to... Oh, you know who it was? It was Fontaine. Fontaine showed me them a freshman year of college, and I was like, bro, this band's a little too heavy for me. <laughs> now I'm like, well... <laughs> uh, but yeah, man, that day is going to be fucking ruckus. I'm actually thinking of getting a hotel room that night and just fucking crashing and driving home in the morning. Like, because that drive home from Worcester, like... I've done it so many times, and it's doable. I used to go even further than I have to go now. But I'm just like... Just the fucking concept of being there all fucking day and driving home at the end of the night. I'm like, uh... I slept during a festival during the day, so I wasn't fully invested. Oh, okay, fair enough. Let me know if you do that. Yeah, absolutely, dude. For sure. I'll book a room in the same hotel. You don't want to share a bed together, Polish? What the fuck's wrong with you? Wow. Um. Yeah, yeah, I got you, dude. I got you. I'll let you know what's up. I'll see if there's anyone else that's interested as well <laughs> in terms of lodging. And maybe there's like a suite somewhere we could totally nab. One dick's distance, broski. Well, that's hey, good news for you. That's like an inch and a half over here. So we're going to be pretty damn close. <laughs> hey, Monster Mom. Perfect timing. <laughs> Always coming in here smiling. It's usually something funny. Uh. Well, cheers to all of you that are here early. Thank you so much for being here. This fucking album dropped like yesterday or Tuesday, and I was like, I'll get around to it. Forgot. And it was in title, and I was like, this new Tsunami? Oh. So I'm pretty sure, Polish, and I gotta look this up really quick now that I'm like, oh, let me double check. Um, I think someone from Tsunami was... Or still is a part of Drain. I just don't remember. Fuck. They don't have like a Wikipedia page or anything? This is bullshit. Where's their ba Oh, they have a band camp. I found it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Mo, welcome in to <laughs> dying. <laughs> nice. I know that there's there's a write up somewhere that explains who's in it, rather than me just googling shit. I mean, yeah, it was mixed by Taylor Young, so that's one thing. He's not from Drain, but he also mixed and produced Drain's album. Both of them. Yeah, I'll have to look up who's in it, but I'm I'm almost certain someone. I think it was the guitar one of the guitar players was or is in Tsunami as well as Drain. If Tree was here, he'd be like, he'd know. Yeah, we do a good mo vibing for sure. Um, and then the other thing that I didn't know is there's a hardcore band called Gulch. They're unfortunately no longer a band anymore. They split up. Their fucking drummer is Drain's lead vocalist. I was like, 
this man can fucking play drums? <laughs> Jesus. He went from sitting in one place going ape shit to now running around and fucking goofily smiling everywhere and screaming his fucking lungs out. Gotta fucking love it. Anywho, um, back on track with shit. Um, on oh, for one, I never switched back to just chatting because I'm a stooge. Are there those shrooms and they should be here tomorrow? So this weekend, I'm going to be in another galactic cluster. Nice. They, um, they just decriminalized, um, psilocybin psilocybin i can't remember how to pronounce it basically the magic mushrooms they um they decriminalized those in salem mass i was pretty impressed i was like wow shit good to hang with you mo while you trip <laughs> you can order shrooms uh i i mean unless there's some other types of shrooms <laughs> most common strain yeah yes yeah, fair enough, Mo. <laughs> and welcome in, Knox. Hope you're doing well, dude. Nobody bats an eye. Yeah, these are, um... I love putting these in my pasta meals. <laughs> uh, yeah. I did shrooms once, and... God. It was a good time, but, man, I, I don't know if I could do it again. It was it was intense. Bodie boy, thank you, BB. Hope you're doing well, dude. Thank you for that lurk. Oh, fuck. Um, hey, for everyone. Yeah, oh, for sure. I feel like if I was microdosing, I'd probably enjoy them more just for, like, those benefits. Um, get some art stuff done. That's pretty good. That's a good idea. It's a good idea. Um, so a couple things uh, that I have for news. For one, I just want to... Oh, shit, I forgot. We actually met the Rage stream. I completely forgot about that. That's how fucking drunk I was all week last week. <laughs> God damn. Oh, we went to Code Orange. Holy shit. Um, so the Rage stream has been funded. Uh, so we'll be doing a Rage stream soon. Basically, once we're done um, with the Amnesia and uh, the Layers of Fear game that comes out. And then we have a couple other things I need to get to that I have keys for that I really wanted to play. So, uh, what the fuck? I think I killed a mosquito on my leg by accident. Um, no, I picked a scab. A very, very small one. I don't know how. Anyways, so yeah, uh, raid stream's going to be happening in the near future. Uh, the VR horror stream will probably take precedence to that. Um, I'm still working out some of the little things here and there to make sure that the stream is not only my having a good time playing it. Well, me having a good time playing a game is subjective. <laughs> I'm able to have a good experience with it. Um, and then on top of that, you all are having a good experience of watching both the game itself and then obviously me standing here looking like a fucking idiot. Um, so yeah, those two things are coming. We're getting close. Um, I just, these, all these new ga these new games had popped out on me and I was like, shit, I got to play these like real soon. Um, cause they're pretty important games to me. Both the amnesia, the amnesia series, like the first one just really like, it really took me back. I was very shocked. Even that, like a, I think it was 12 years old at the time, maybe 10, 10 or 12 years old at the time. And I was like, wow, I'm like, this still really holds up. Well, it was a very good game. Um, and then there's, uh, Layers of Fear, which I've mentioned a few times on stream before. Um, that first one was the first hard game I ever played when I bought this house and I was by myself playing it and like scared the fucking shit out of me and really helped me take another further step into the realm of horror gaming again for the first time since I've basically been a kid. Uh, we'll blame it on, uh, real time strategy games and, uh, Call of Duty. <laughs> Anywho. Um, so that's come out down the pipeline. Uh, I don't think I had as much else that I really wanted to talk about for news or anything like that. Um, oh. 
Okay, uh, one thing I will say we're going to add on as well, um, and I may even do a bonus stream with it because I obviously have an obsession with them, but uh, Chilla's Art is dropping a new game tomorrow. Um, actually, in a handful of hours, really. Uh, but um, it's it, what is it called? It's going to be called Night Security. Uh, it is... Uh, actually, so typically when we play those games, it's by two brothers. Uh, we'll call them the Chilla brothers for lack of other names. So they typically work together on developing all the games. This game coming out tomorrow is the first game where their hands are involved with it. But the third Chilla brother that exists, it's going to be his uh, his first game in development. So uh, I'm excited to see their brother style kind of mixed because obviously they're releasing under under their um moniker so they're going to want it to feel like a chillas game but let him handle the story and like putting everything together uh that's my assumption at least so i'm excited for that to come out and then they also have another one in development called parasocial which i'm looking forward to with a mysterious third brother yes <laughs> yes um so I'll be sneaking that in. There's a bunch of demos I still haven't played. Uh, Killer Frequency is going to be played. Everyone that I know that's played that, uh, horror streamer or not, said it was a fucking awesome game. Um, so like we got a we got a key for that out of nowhere, just given to us, and I was like, okay. Uh, and that was the rank one. If you didn't want to know what rank one is, if you look down below in the about section, there's like a whole section of games that like I that are on like my I need to play these, currently playing them, and then have played. And there's also like my favorite games of all time, like listed there too. Um, but yeah, I've been just like updating that over the last like like year or so. Um, ever since I so ever since I met One Speed because he was using it, and I was like, that's that's a really fucking cool little widget. I'm gonna use that. Um, yeah, I just got an email one day, and they were. I was like, "Hey, we here at Rank One are working with you know this PR team, and they wanted to give you Killer Frequency." And I was like, "Oh, that's something." I was <laughs> like, "Okay," didn't ask for it here. I, there is no way to ask for them. It was just like they reached out to me via an email and just gave me that shit. And I was like, "Wow." Yo, NYC, what's up? Welcome in, friend. Have you been? Can I fucking stop bleeding, please? God damn it. <clears throat> um, I completely lost my trend of thought. Anyways, um, so before we get into Amnesia Rebirth here, um, I owe, uh, as you can see up here, quite a few... Uh, wheel spins so we're gonna we're gonna spin the wheel maybe twice we'll see i'm doing great thanks How about me about me i'm doing pretty good i'm chilling having a beer i had uh i had three blueberry mojitos with dinner they were good enjoyed them went out with some uh some family uh that i couldn't see around my birthday last week because unfortunately uh my dad came down with covid for uh, a few days he's doing better test negative and all that so everything's good um yeah, he was he was not having a good time. So <laughs> uh so I'm glad that he's 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 looking better too. He definitely looked like he was still tired, but um Oh thank you. Yeah, yeah, we had a we had a killer time last week. We had a we had a bit of thon last week. Uh that ended up lasting. Uh we did a stream Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. Uh Wednesday was my actual birthday, and I was actually in a show with Polish hoax, so I couldn't stream. Uh, and it ended Friday, uh, real close to midnight. So it was basically like four full like stream days worth of stuff that we ended on. Thank you, appreciate that. Yeah, he slips in here every once in a while. By the way, you'll uh, you'll know it's him because his uh, his handle name is quote die Trump die. <laughs> hmm. you... Yes, <laughs> correct, Fry. Correct response. <laughs> oh shit anywho um let me add some more music to my list right now because i'm pretty sure we're already like halfway through this one 
Oh, I haven't listened to this. Trap Them in a fucking minute. Add that. That's a good length of an album, too. So it'll keep us busy. Live is handling. Love it. <laughs> I've, I've yet to find someone that says they don't like it. So that's interesting. Um. All right. So, yeah. Let me let me do a, a spin here and see how we do. I just hope I don't get absolutely fucking smoked. I'm going to get fucking beef jerky off the bat here. Come on. I spoke it into existence. It's my fault now. Oh my no! Oh my fucking god. Bye, Fry. It just rolled past jerky and it was slowing down chocolate. I was like, oh, I totally just missed that. <laughs> right into fucking nut five. Yeah. Uh, this is the hottest thing that is on this wheel. It is a peanut that is covered in a ton of different peppers, including Carolina Reaper peppers and the soon to be crowned hottest pepper in the world, Pepper X. Uh, this thing hurts and, um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it was kind of a joke at first and it's, it's evolved from eating some like hot jelly beans to this whole wheel of monstrosity bullshit. This is the death nut. Yep. Number five is the death nut. Um, so yeah, so I, I figure, so what I do now, uh, some of like the hot sauces I actually went and got, uh, from someone that lives in, um, upstate New York. Uh, I wanted to help out a small business and they make fantastic hot sauces. Some of them are very hot. Have you ever eaten a ghost pepper? I've never eaten a ghost pepper in terms of like a pepper and eat it. Like that's one thing I haven't really done yet is legitimately just start eating like raw peppers. It's been in the forms of like hot sauces, chocolate bars, peanuts, uh, a gummy bear, like all this other shit. So uh, to answer your question, no. <laughs> uh, but I do have, and it was gifted to me by a one laser lady, who's a dear friend of the channel and the community. Uh, she bought these off of my throne wish list. These are ghost pepper blue raspberry hard candies, and they are tasty. Well, that's four. Uh, where's the opening of the back? Oh, there it is. Okay, I got a little worried there. So, this guy here. Yeah, there's Pepper X Peppers, Carolina Reaper Peppers, Maruga Scorpion Peppers, and, and Carolina Reaper Powder. So just, they double up on their fucking Reaper. They give you Maruga Scorpion, which is hot as hell also, and then Pepper X, which is the the pepper. This is the Death Nut. The heat level is wild. You could, oh, let me, uh, boop. You could see it here. It's number five, the Death Nut. This is it. Um, they, they're just a little bag of peanuts, um, as opposed to eating the entire bag and being done with it forever, I figured I would stretch out my, uh, punishments and eat one peanut at a time. So that's how we do it here. With this will, you will have clear sciences for the rest of your life. You, nope. Sadly, it's not true. Uh, not last stream, but I think the stream before... I literally ate a hot sauce and then like I turned a fan on because I got hot and it kicked up some dust in the corner of my office and immediately my sinuses closed. <laughs> did not work. I wish it did though. That'd be great. I would love to have sinuses clear for the rest of my life because uh, I don't really know what it feels like. <laughs> I knew what it felt like for maybe maybe a day and a half after I got my uh, my septum got realigned because it was really it was severely deviated. Um. So when I got all the packing and shit taken out, it was, like, clear pathways. And then, like, by the next day, my, like, usual allergies kicked in. It doesn't help I'm allergic to dogs, and I have two of them that sleep in bed with me, but... 
You know, you make sacrifices in life. I take a hit on my physical health so that I can help my mental and emotional health because I love my dogs and they give me lots of lots of loving and um like a lot of dopamine. So anyways, I'm definitely stalling. Uh, thank you all for not saying anything. I appreciate it. Oh, God. I'm trying to get a piece out without having, like, anything spurt the fuck out and land it. Because if I lose one of these on the ground, first and foremost, it's going to make a noise when it falls. Faint. You won't hear it. I won't hear it. The dogs will. And they will be in here so fast you would ever fell on the ground that uh, they'd be able to find it before I could. Speaking of which, one just walked into the room. <laughs> you don't want one of these, Mila. You don't want this, I promise you. You're, you're stepping on the cord. No. Do you want to come up again? You were on stream the other night. Here, come here. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I knew you. I knew it. There she is. Yeah, that's my good girl. This is my oldest one. You can't have the peanut. She's a good girl. She's terrified of most things, though. Oh. That's my good girl. I need to go back in the other room and lay down and watch Degrassi on TV. It's your favorite show. She will actually sit there and watch episodes of Degrassi. <laughs> Thank you. She knows it, too. Uh, All right, Mila... I have to eat this this peanut now, and it's going to be disgusting, and it's going to be really spicy, and I don't want you to see me like this. <laughs> She's like, what do you mean? Everybody loves you, you know, yet you're afraid of everybody. I don't get it. No, you can't have the peanut. Oh, she found it. Fuck. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> you can't have the peanut. You would be you would be in misery. From I trust me, because I'm about to be in misery. I love you, but no. Ready? Go get it. I threw it. It's over there. Uh she's gonna be so mad at me for that. She's around she's just sniffing everywhere, like, where the fuck is it? Oh, she came back like I see it in your hands. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't let you have it. No. Mila. No. All right, so she sits. She's like, okay. I'm sitting. I'm a good girl now. Oh, God. This is the first song I ever heard by this band. I thought they were a different band. Showed up to their set. But at this point in the song, like, at least 15 people already got punched in the face. I was like, I'm going to go to the other stage and watch the other band now. And now I fucking love them. Ugh, all right. Whew. Keep a bag of pup treats up there. Oh, shh. you know, the thing is I would, but typically they're usually sleeping with their mom at this time of night, but she's, um, she's pet sitting. So it's just me and them. So I leave the door open. They can come in and go as they please. But typically the, my door is closed in the office and then the bedroom door is closed too. And they're sound asleep. Do you have milk? Yeah. Downstairs. Um, I, it's funny enough though. I find that milk actually for me doesn't really do much. Um, if it's, so she visiting. Yeah. <laughs> um, if I use like a whole milk, it'll give me a couple of seconds of relief and then it just comes right back. Um, anything lower than that, like 2%, 1% or even skim, um, it will just make it worse. Like, I'll take a sip, and there's, like, a momentary, like, oh, God, because it's cold. And then it just, like, multiplies. It's really weird. I think it's a me thing. Because <laughs> other people I've seen eat hot things. They're, like, guzzling milk. So, but yeah, that and um, usually bread really helps, too. And I have some croissants downstairs. Just plain old croissants, little ones. <laughs> so, anywho, this is the death nut, everybody. Um, this actually, it doesn't look like there's much, uh, stuff on it, but I can assure you that it's like baked into, it's like baked onto the peanut and there's a little bit of dusting on it. 
bread help. Yeah, yeah. Um, unlike the beef jerky, the Carolina Reaper beef jerky that just looks like it was rolled around in like some orange sludge. But anyways, <sighs> search drugs. Let me be the sacrifice. <laughs> I would never sacrifice my dogs for anything. I would sacrifice myself for my dogs first. Let's be honest. Yeah, I would. I would. That's great. Give me the peanut. <laughs> All right. And hello, Tree. How are you doing, my friend? Oh God! <clears throat> eh, super so comes soon and be the best part of my day. Yeah, it's not like we're having a rough day. I ask how you are, but yeah. <clears throat> oh my God! It's a good thing I've built myself up to get here. If this is one of the first things I ever did, I would have been in big trouble. What am I drinking? Uh, I just have some water uh, right now. And um, and I have a Genesee cream ale. <laughs> I find that beer sometimes can actually make it worse, depending on the type of beer. Um, especially if it's more on the hoppier side. I remember drinking an IPA one time while I think I was doing a jelly bean that was a spicy jelly bean and it made it like 30 times worse. It was miserable. Nut. Thank you. <laughs> Nut. Appreciate the biddies, dude. Oh. Like the back of my mouth is on fucking fire right now. Which, of all things, I'd prefer that. It's when like... I have some of the hot sauce and it ends up on the outside of my lips and dries my lips out. Oh, like just thinking about it. I need chapstick. Like <laughs> that's how, that's how fucking terrible that is. Oh, I used to never use chapstick until I met my wife and she goes through, she goes through probably one chapstick every couple of weeks. Hottest thing you have ever eaten? Honestly, this. Um, no. This one is currently the hottest thing that I eat. But I think the mo I think the hottest thing I've ever eaten was probably the little nitro gummy bear. It was a regular sized little gummy bear, like from Har. It looked like it was from Haribo, and uh, I think that was like I think it was I think it was two million Scoville units. And it was fucking miserable. I remember like eating ice cream. I was like gurgling on eggnog for like fucking 25 minutes. There's a video on my YouTube somewhere of that. <laughs> it's uh it's aggressive. Oh yeah, it was it was very rough. Um my friend Treebeard here was kind enough to uh, actually uh, clip me one time when I was saying that, yeah, I would do the one chip challenge if I make partner as a joke. And now that exists on the internet. What the hell was that? Did I just gleek on myself thinking there was something dripping from my ceiling? I mean, there's nothing up there. And it wasn't the dog because she's over in the other room staring at me. <laughs> it's that nut you threw? Oh my word. No, I trust me. I chomped on it and went down the gullet. Oh. Oh. Oh, so side note. Um I actually joined our dear friend Sassafras last night on her stream. We played some Outlast Trials, and uh, 
I act we actually uh unlocked Project X and did the first uh trial out of it. And um yeah, I just I love Outlast Trials. This game is this game has been so good for an early release game. And um I definitely got well worth the thirty dollars out of the price tag, so I'm happy. God. I forgot this there's like a second win that hits of this and it's like Fuck. Like, I'm starting to feel the adrenaline rush where it, like, it feels like your skin's starting to, like, crawl. Ugh. Or maybe that's my anxiety. I don't know. <laughs> Ugh. I want to ask Charles in a raffle, but I can't play it as I need to replace my motherboard. Oh, yeah, that's right. That sucks. Well, when you get when you get your PC up and running again, make that one of your first one of your first installs. It's uh, it's well worth the time investment. It's really fun. It it takes the like like bare bone concept similar to that of like GTFO, um. And said, let's do this, but in the Outlast uh, universe. Um, and no guns. You just have, like, bricks and bottles and a couple other things and a rig. And that's it. Loose tissues for the jerky? <laughs> well, wait, yes. I'll just say yes. <laughs> I watch people play. It looks fun. Yeah, it is. Yep. Oh. My stomach just yelled at me. It was like, what is this? It's like, man, you had a late dinner tonight? I don't want this in me. Oh, so Endeavor, welcome in, by the way. Um, so Treebeard here in chat is my DM. And uh, so it was me, him, uh, two other people in the party were there. One person, <laughs> one person was not able to make it. He had um, some family plans. He had to handle out of state. Uh, had to travel away for it and everything. And uh, the other member of the party was Noxler, a uh, fellow streamer friend. Uh, he was not there, and we couldn't find him. And we were DMing him. And uh, me and Treebeard ended up watching some uh, some wrestling on TV. And like forty five minutes in. Bloop. In comes Noxler. Hey, guys. <laughs> so, we did not get to play D&D &D yesterday, unfortunately. Slept all fucking fat. Do you mean day? <laughs> Should have killed him off. <laughs> oh, God. How dare you? <laughs> I am present. <laughs> oh my god, my stomach. Oh. It feels like it's on fire. Maybe guzzling guzzling water immediately after eating the peanuts not a good idea. In certain situations, yes. Not last night though. Oh. Nice. I'm right, moving it down to a 45 count. Ugh. Oh. That sucks. Well, I hope your character dies too. That is rude. Oh. Uh, all right, we're about the 45 minute mark of being live. And I told myself I wouldn't go beyond that without starting amnesia. Oh. I stay up late one time. Hey, you know what? You learned your lesson, I guess. 
Oh. <laughs> yeah, next week's going to be fun. And instead of being down one person, we'll probably be... Oh, no, we will still be down one person because uh, Sean's getting married on Friday. Tomorrow. Fuck. I have to shoot him a quick DM before I go to sleep tonight. That was... It, wedding was such a nerve-wracking day for me. Until the, once the ceremony was over, I was like, oh, this is relaxed after that. Oh, it's next Friday. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you for that. <clears throat> wow, Knox, that's aggressive. And why would we kill Sean? You mean his character? <laughs> Man, so fucking aggro. I should change the music. You're getting way too aggressive listening to Code Orange. <laughs> yes, character. Uh, those there. Um. Okay. <clears throat> I'm all bent out of shape, sorry. <laughs> what, you just bent over too hard right now? <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, dude. Like, honestly, like, it's... what Like, no one was that upset about it. We're just kind of like, uh, fuck. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm gonna try to muster through this, because I'd like to get... See if I can get it to rebirth today. Um, if not, beat it, so... Hello there. Bootylicious! What's up? Welcome in. I think we'll touch grass at 7 a.m. tomorrow. I fucking hate last minute plans. I don't want to go hike. So don't. Just say you don't want to go. What's the big deal? <laughs> oh, you know what I didn't do? Um, I didn't change this to rebirth. Oops. Boop. Boop. Okay. Sleep in the grass. <laughs> Hello? Uh. Uh, one minute. There's no audio. I feel like this happened with, um, a machine for pigs also, which is really strange. All right, I'm going to relaunch it. No big deal. You tried that approach? What, to sleep in the grass? Or to say that you don't want to go? Like, you're an adult. You can tell people you don't want to go do things. I mean, there may be consequences to not doing something, but... All right. Now we're good. Tassie Treonin, alone in the desert, pregnant and ill, is trying to reach a nearby town where the survivors of her expedition have found help. She found an abandoned fortress and a route to the town, but a mishap with a cannon has sent her plummeting deep into ancient structures under the fortress. Now she must find a way out. Yep. <clears throat> Maybe if I eat enough grass, I can go get my stomach pumped or something. Oh, yeah, that's right. We got, yeah, we fell. So I got to push stuff off of me. Drop out of life with bong in hand. Follow the smoke to other rift filled land. Drop out of life with bong in hand. Follow the smoke to other rift filled land. Yes. What? We broke, we felt our ribs break, but they're not broken. I don't know how to tell. Shit. Oh, right. We were in this tank thing trying to blow up that wall. Oh, that's right. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Uh. Any holes around here anywhere? No. Straight up, maybe? No. Fuck. Wait. 
I can rotate it. That makes sense. Hey! Oh. All right. That's the only grass touching I want to do. <laughs> I need to get out of here. Oh fuck! We fell a long way down. This is like fucking catacomb shit. What's this? Oh! Interesting. Oh, I can light the, uh... torches. That's nice. What's this? Oh. Yeah, I move. More matches. That's good. Alright. Let's go see if what's in here now. Well, shit. I'm assuming that door up there is locked. It is. What's this? Why can't I knock on it? It's not letting me knock. Whatever. Anywho, that door's locked. We're gonna go, uh, adventure down deeper, I guess, because that seems like a good idea. Interesting. Okay. Hello? Hey, hey, hey! Why isn't this working anymore? Oh, right, I'm out of fucking, uh... What the fuck? What? What is... Oh. oh. That, that was you. I can feel you. I felt you move. Jesus. No oil lantern. Fuck. We'll get you home. Uh, whenever baby kicks you check on it to reduce your fear. That's pretty cool. If we are to investigate further, we will need to build a scaffold. We will need wood and a good length of rope. I think there is some break in the walls deep below. The water level used to be much higher. We can see light shining through the water. Interesting. Oh, I forgot that I actually lights one. Fuck. Okay, well, here we go. Anyone else? No? Okay, good. All right, we gotta move some shit. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? I have to manually, like, click this every time. It's kind of annoying, but that's whatever. Oh, there we go. Please, one more, one more. Ah, damn it. Nope, nope, we're good here. Thank you. Fuck. Um, okay. I wish I could just take the fucking torch. I mean, it's 
It looks like it's probably like rusted in there anyways, but fuck wrong button. Yeah, let's not look at that, eh? Sunlight down there. It is. Interesting. What the fuck is this place? Alright, is this gonna raise the water up or down? I'm not sure. Oh, it opens these doors. Oh. No, no, keep going, please. There we go. Fantastic. Here, catch. Oh. Alright, just don't look down. Just don't look down, we got it. Stay oh, fuck! Stay calm. Stay calm. <laughs> I just instinctually jumped. I jump scared in and out of game. Oh, uh, fuck. I'm sorry, Mila. I know, I know. She's like, why are you yelling? Wait, can I lift this up higher or anything? No? All right, well. There's got to be another button for it. Does that be another... What's the reminder? Oh, that thing. Okay. I think there's going to be another button I can press to do this. What the fuck? I saw it at the last second. I was too busy listening to Tater bark. Something was crawling over there. Put the screen there so you can't just jump over to it. Smart. Who are you barking at? Not you, but Tater. Who's she barking at? Windows aren't even open. Ding dong. Instant karma. <laughs> Great. Figured. Making my way downtown. Oh, we got here. Oh, hell yeah. Wait, what's that? Oh, okay, good, good, good. If we're quick about this, it'll work. Fuck, alright, I'm gonna get into the light. ALO? The fuck was that thing? Ew. Gross ass fucking bugs. There's another one over here somewhere I know there is. Yep. Ah, oh, you bastard. Whatever. <clears throat> the queen had no king. Many princes came to court her, but none brought her joy. She was sad because she wanted a child. She asked her wise people to help, but they said, Why do you want a child? We are all your children. I must have a baby, she said, because I cannot be queen forever, and someone must be queen after me. Nonsense, said the wise people. We will brew you a magic potion, and then you will live forever. You will always be our queen. So that is what they did. 
But sometimes when she was alone, the queen cried because although she was mother to the world, it was not enough. That's sad. I don't think there's anything shiny over there for me. What about over here? Hey, hey, hey. That's what's up. It is the third day. I have fallen with a group of Moorish travelers. One of them is suffering, struck with the curse of the king's evil. So I prayed with them for her fortitude, that she might reach the cave of the mother with all speed. They tell me that Tesempt is within two days' journey, should all go well. Yet there is an obstacle still to overcome. The path goes through the... D the... Demesnes? Demains? Of one Tarkan rise. Raise. A robber baron of the Ottoman people. Pilgrims must pay a heavy tithe to use his water and to travel the mountain pass. I have spice and three thalers left. I pray it will be sufficient. Yikes. Hoping for the best, bruh. Excuse me. Excuse me. What's this? On that day, the people oh, the body this is like, um... When the, door the first game they had those. Opened, the name of their new empress rippled through the crowd before her like dye into water. Tehana. 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 She stepped down, bareheaded and barehanded, dressed in a simple robe, and she walked amongst the people. Some cried out with joy, some wept openly. Behind her came Tamaku and the rest of the alchemists, bearing a litter on which rested seven crystal orbs. Okay. What in the name of God? Will it do it again if I press it? Yes, it does. Okay, so just like the, uh... She stepped behind... Okay, enter skipping. Okay. That's just like the first game. That's really interesting. Alright. Azrael Guisha, ruling in the southwest part of the world, and hath twenty great dukes attend him in the day, and as many in the night, who have under them several servants to attend them. And we mention eight of the chief dukes that belong to the day, and as many that belong to the night, because they are sufficient for practice. And the first four that belong to the day hath forty servants apiece under them, and so hath the first four that belong to the night, and the last four of the day, twenty and the last four of the night, ten apiece. That was one sentence. <laughs> they are all good-natured and willing to obey thee, those that are of the day to be called in the day, and those of the night in the night. And these be their names and seals that followeth. His eight dukes follow that belong to the day. <laughs> Alliterus seal, Karga seal. Bunyal seal, Rabba seal. Arasat seal, Ariel seal. Quopiel seal, Malugal seal. I don't know what the fuck any of that is. What in the world? There's going to be a puzzle soon that's about that. I'm not going to know what's going on. And here we go. Going deeper and deeper. Locked. Cool. Fuck it. We out skis. Which is your favorite amnesia? Um, so far the first one was my favorite, Dark Descent. Um, a machine for pigs I was a little critical of. I didn't hate it, but I also wasn't in love with it. And then this is the third one being Rebirth. It was made years after the first two. It's coming out in 2020. I was been meaning to play it for a while and I just never got around to it, but here we are. Um, and then the bunker just came out like two weeks ago. And I'm going to be playing that right after this. Single quick flaunt. Okay, I was going to see. Was that one of you? It's probably a reason, a very good reason why this door is closed. Do I care? Clearly not. Ooh! Oh, 
Oh. No fucking words. Oh. Nobody saw that. What, what, what? Oh, shit! Daddy Uwu. God damn it. I think it's gone. That's cool. Further we go. And guess who just ran out of fucking fluid? This fucking guy. Oh, you f fuck. I had that last one. Okay. You know what, really quick, let me just see if, I'm pretty sure there's a hotkey for that. I just wanna just double check. It's R, okay. That makes life a lot easier. I'm like, I have to keep hitting tab for this shit? This is dumb. Nice, okay. So the point is to get all the way down to the bottom, and we're getting pretty close here. This way it looks like I can go down here and play with some gizmos. Ooh, three more matches. Very nice. So what are these three going to do? All right, she's going to do boom, boom, and that. Interesting. So basically go down here, in there, back around, out here, and onto this platform of sorts. But the problem is, is... Ooh, ooh, okay, okay. The darkness. It feels like I'm losing control. We need to find a way out, little one. Uh, that opens that one, and then those two things come out. What, this way? The problem is I can't control that from over there, so I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing with this thing. Looks like I can go up right here. wonder if that's what this is. It is. Okay. So this is left and right. That's up and down. This just only opens... Me, I gotta get a better look at it. 
Now I gotta move it over a bit more to the right to make this jump, because obviously that door's not gonna open. I mean, unless, of course, like... Sick. That's not a good sign. Yeah, I can't lift that. Okay, that's expected, I guess. So... Oh, I can make this jump, actually. Or not. Alright, 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 alright. I'll go back and fix it a bit. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, game. Clearly they wanted to use an invisible wall there for whatever reason. That's just dandy. Oh, oh I hit the wrong one. My bad. That's enough. Hello. There we go. Alright, see that wasn't too bad. It's interesting they had the other ones that would make it go up higher. Cause there's like I mean I guess you get oh, up there. Yeah. Daddy darkness. What in the fuck tree? <laughs> Did I just miss a jump scare? Uh, no, I think you made it just on time. What's up, demon? Welcome in, bud. Like, you go up here, but, like, how would I possibly get on this thing and be able to ride it up, but also control it from over there? I don't know. That seems kind of sketch. <laughs> oh, yeah. R. I'm not a... No, fuck off. You know I'm gonna go, like, check it out, though. Fuck. What's that? Hey! Yes! Oh, my dude, let's go. That's fucking big. I hate this thunderstorm right now. Fucking with my Wi-Fi? Oh, that sucks. Alright, we're gonna... We're, let's, we'll do it here, we'll do it here. That's light. It's a light so I just figured out how this works now. So the problem is, is how do I possibly get back? Oh, I have to open the door. That's what I have to do. I'm so dumb. This way was, this way was just how to, um, I don't know what that was, but I'm not going to stop. I'm not stopping. This game is just an extension on darkness, imprisoning me. All that I see, God absolute horror middle dot I cannot live. Oh, I cannot shit. die. Trapped in myself, body my holding cell middle dot. What the fuck happened here? Anyway. Now I know what to do. So this has to go all the way over, I think, to get out from under- Oh no! I know what to do. Right there. We close these doors temporarily. And this now can go up. No fucking way, dude. It- It starts falling immediately? That's hogwash if it does that. How on earth am I going to be able to do... Oh, wait. Hold on. It took me a second. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bro! 
perfect. See, just a little bit of thought. You can get through any of these puzzles. Shit, we're almost out of gas already with this. So what's going on right now? Um, so basically, our character was in a this plane crash. Um, and we're pregnant. We, uh, everyone we were with, apparently we were sleeping or something. Everyone was essentially, like, sleeping or doing whatever. I mean, we were sleeping. They were off, like, trying to find help. And um, we're out looking for them, and we actually found our husband. Uh, he died, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, so right now we we uh, we were trying to get through this old fortress, and uh, what ended up happening was um, not this, not that, but there's another room. There was a tank we found. We loaded it with a mortar shell to blow up a part of a wall to keep going forward. And the explosion was so much coming like out of the barrel, it shook the ground and we fell into this underground like keep. Oh, oh this is a whole thing here, okay. I'd say so, yeah. How in the duck is she moving this fast? Well, she's not like she's not uber pregnant. I don't know what's happening. She's definitely like I think it's late first trimester, early second trimester. It's like three, four months. But like, there's definitely something going on because she said that she felt like, because we, when we fell. Oh, it's because we're kind of in the dark here. Hold on. I, I'm stuck. I hear some like weird talking. Fuck you, America. <laughs> Alright. We have no more lantern juice? Fuck. We got five more matches. Let's hope they count for something. What? How'd that already go out? Oh, because I sprinted. God, I'm dumb. Oh, it's Jesus, that scared the fuck out of me. Lady Shoes! Yo, what's up? Welcome in, friend. Oh, God. Yo, Jeff, welcome in. How you, pal? Lady, how are you? How was, uh, how was the games tonight? Hope all is well. We're just, uh, we're playing some Amnesia Rebirth. I've uh, been enjoying it so far. Uh, getting some platforming puzzle type stuff at the moment, so it's been pretty fun. A little bit of, a little bit of scary, scariness in there. I'm so tired, had internet issues. Oh, stupid. Internet's the worst. <laughs> it's the best and worst thing ever invented. Well, I don't blame you if you, if you got to raid and scoot and go chill out. Uh, do whatever it is you got to do after stream. And then, um, yeah, go lay down, get some rest. Uh, but if for some reason you hit a second wind, we'll be around for a few hours. We'll be happy to have you. Okay, so I got to open up another goddamn door. Oh, there was one. God damn it. All right, these doors slam shut behind me, so we gotta move kind of quickly. Fuck. What in the fuck is going on here? Ooh, okay, good. I'm glad I got that. More matches. Fuck. What happened here? Fuck, no, no. Oh!
Oh my god! Go away? Fuck everything about that. <gasps> I wasn't even afraid of the fucking bones. It, she gasped as I opened the fucking door and it scared me. <laughs> God damn it. Oh. I wish I could hide in one of these things. Fuck this game, dude. <sighs> that nearly fucking ended me. I didn't realize he was right fucking there. Oh. Nothing. Jesus, fuck. I clipped that gasp scare. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh. Fuck this, dude. Fuck everything about this.
Fuck. Nothing. All right. All right. There we go. All right. Good, good, good. That gets some of the fear out of there. All right. Good. What I got left? Six. That's going to be for emergencies, I suppose. Is there something on the compass I can look for? No. Okay. Shit. Fuck this, dude. Oh, God. There we go. That's good enough for me. All right, where are we? Oh, we're almost on the ground. We're getting there. We're almost out of here. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Fuck. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, you son of a bitch! Oh, they're gonna fuck. <laughs> oh, why? Can opener. What the fuck? <sighs> Where is this bringing me? Oh, that looks good. Nice reassuring. Fucking Christ. I'm not turning around, I'm not turning around, I'm not turning around, I'm not turning around. I'm not doing it. Get up! Get the fuck out of here! Jesus fucking Christ! Fuck everything about this place, dude. Never again. Ugh. Some sunlight here. We'll get out of here soon enough. What the fuck? What? Who are you? What do you want? God damn it. Could you maybe give me some fuel for my torch? No? Alright, that's... That's great. Thanks. Uh... Oh, shit. Uh, suck through a riptide? Hello? <laughs> well done, precious one. Next chapter. <clears throat> Oh, 
Yeah, that uh looks kind of painful, but at least we made it out. Uh oh. Hold on. We good? We good? Hey. No. No, I'm sorry. Please. Please be okay. I'm sorry, my love. Just a moment. Just let me know you're all right. That's not good. Right, we'll be careful, though. I go away from whatever the fuck that place was. I hope I didn't hurt you. This fucking thing. What are you? Who? Who are you? What do you want? Yeah. I want some answers, damn it. Well, look at this nice oasis. Oh, so she's getting her memory back. Right, right, right. Okay. So Hank must have died around here somewhere. Oh, Christ. This feels good. Don't drink too much. And uh, fill up the flasks, bottles, whatever you have. What is that? A little post. Huh. Random. Oh great, another fucking scary looking cave. Or it's not a cave, it's just whatever this is. Oh. Hello? Why aren't you working? Is that the compass? Doesn't it do that? It goes rant and then it like opens it. That's weird. Huh. Right, we'll just look elsewhere, I suppose. Christ Almighty! Don't go near it, Tazi. Follow hope, life. I think, I think she's trying to help us. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! My God! It's a fucking devil. He's wanted us. Great, so that thing that's been chilling with us is a fucking devil. Nice. Well, thanks. Appreciate you. 4th of March, 1937. I am Tezitrianum. I survived the crash of the plane, Cassandra. With me are Hank Mitchell, Yasmin Shabani, <laughs> Dr. Anton Metzier, Leon de Vries, and Malik Tambura. My husband, Selim, and others are in a cave near the crash, and need help. Some have died. Richard Fairchild could not handle what we saw here. He ran. Alex Sterling has gone after him. Gotta get to bed, I hope the rest of your stream is good. Thank you, Jeff. Appreciate you. And look who it is! The man with the nicest mustache I've ever seen. Was badly wounded by a creature. Hi, Twy. Welcome in. A flesh eating Oh, so I was going to try to watch your clip and I'm like, I forgot to hit pause. I look like Chase from Creeping Death. That's fair. I'll take that. I just clipped that. Nice. Um, it'd be nice if you shouldn't read it a second time. Okay, good. <clears throat> How was your stream, bud? 
Uh, I think when I checked in on you, you were playing Valorant. Did you get any W's? Any dubs, as the kids would say? Rating and running. I'm going to make cheeseburgers and put the kids to sleep. Ooh, fantastic. Well, I hope you enjoy your cheeseburgers, sir. Yo, Episky, what's up? Welcome in, welcome in. I didn't play it in a long time, so the dubs didn't even feel like dubs, as the kids say. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, man. Well, go enjoy your cheeseburgers. Get the kiddos to bed. Um, I'll be here for a while, if you happen to be up and around. Um, I unlocked Program X in Outlast Trials, by the way. It's uh, it's interesting. Um, let's see. Oh, I have to go all the way through it again. I see, I see. Corey was asking about it earlier. Nice. Okay. Uh, so this is her talking about uh, Hank. Hank Mitchell, our leader, my friend, was badly wounded by a creature in the fort. Yasmin, Yasmin calls it a ghoul, a flesh-eating monster from Desert Legends. She may be right. Hank losing blood fast and he will die. There's no time to get to help. There's a shrine here to a local spirit. This will sound like madness. She appeared to us, a figure of glowing light. She spoke to us. She offered healing and to save us from the desert. And I, I agreed. She led us to an amulet hidden in the shrine. I took it. Now there's a shimmering doorway in the rock. I swear it wasn't there before. If we step through, Hank might live. He is so pale. Oh, Salim, I don't know what else to do. This is crazy, but I promise, I promise I will return to you. Oh, God. So this is where everything went down. And why couldn't I walk through here? Do I not have the amulet anymore? Like, is this not an amulet? All right, maybe, maybe we did need an amulet, and I just don't have it yet. So yeah, for anyone that's still in here from um, the uh, Lady Shoes raid or from the Heavy Hand Swings raid, if you don't know me, I'm the Juggernaut. I Tassi. play horror games. Tassi. Hello. Yes, yes, I'm here, Doctor. Oh, it's so good to hear your voice. Ah. You are still... Well... Where are you? The Oasis. We were here before. What happened to us? I just read... Uh, something I wrote. There's a spirit. A, a glowing spirit. I've seen her. I will explain it all, Tarsi. Come to the village. We have lit a beacon in the tower. Look for the smoke. Thank you. Thank you. Doctor, you talked about my blackouts. I have these marks on my skin, and I keep losing control. You gave me a medicine. What's wrong with me? I, uh, I do not know for certain. We need diagnostic implements, reference books, civilization. Remember, Tassi, control yourself. Avoid fear. Avoid anger at all costs. I have to go. Yes, she needs me. Doctor? Doctor! He's like, hey, fuck off, see ya. Huh. So he knows something he's not telling us. <clears throat> okay. Let's get a hustle on because all we do is get to this village and everything's gonna be so much better. Ooh. There it is. There's the smoke. And the sun's going down so that it's not going to be as hot. I don't have to stay in the shade as often, I think. I th I think. It can't be far. It's probably super far. Little one. A village. People. A way home. Paris. You love Paris. We'll go walking in the Luxembourg Gardens. I'll show you where Alice used to play. I knew be it. Okay, Please be okay. The, at first, I thought this was supposed to be like leading up to Alice being born, and I was like, mm, there's too many memories here. I think Alice might be dead. <laughs> and I was right. 
Shit, I think I am cooking in the sun still. Yep. When we get to the village, you can meet the doctor. And Yasmin. Yo, Ken. She's from Algeria. Welcome in. She's How you nice. doing? And we'll figure out what's wrong with me. All will be well. All will be well. I run across. We're good. Fucking bird again. I good. How's you? I'm good. I'm good. Just playing some amnesia. Um. So odd. This isn't working for anything. Um. I'm meaning to ask you, what did you think of Outlast Trials? I know you were playing it a bit last night. What in the fuck? I really don't like this. Here we go. Goods, I enjoyed it. Oh shit. Chaotic as hell, but I liked no. it. Yeah. Quicksand. What the fuck? Oh shit, indeed. Where the fuck are we now? Oh, good. Christ. More underground we so shit. Close. What the hell is this place now? <laughs> Are you there, little one? Oh, fuck this. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Oh, Pandora, thank you so much for the, the lurk. I appreciate you. I hope you're doing well. You guys are close, so close to the exit. Yeah, what the f This is that place that I saw from the plane before we crashed. I thought we had some type of weird portal. Oh, this is fucked. What is this? Oh. There's... All right, that's good news. I may not know where we are, but at least you're still with me. I'm so glad you're all right. Oh, this is a closet? Oh. So glad the alien race has matchbooks. God, this is fucking crazy. This is, like, look at that! Not what I was expecting out of this game. I'm not mad, I'm just like, what the fuck? <laughs> the fuck? Next the chapter. Was very deep, or she fell very slowly, for she had plenty of time as she went down to look about her, and to wonder what was going to happen next. Well, oh, little one. Every step we take, it feels like we're further from home. No shit. There must be a way back. What the fuck? Oh, cool. PDAs. Okay, it just decided to do that. 
<clears throat> Under the sign of Ranu on the third rise at the first calling, I, Atharu, make this record. I have completed the comparison of the samples from the Empress and from the bones of her mother, Blessed Atua. It is clear now that both carry the sickness, although it did not manifest in the forebears. While Vitae is powerful enough to rebind bone and sinew, without repeated application, the health again deteriorates. A single dose is no cure. It merely deri it drives the decay back for a time. Tamaku orders thy test. Repeated application, quantities, insertion points, timings in her name. So this is... So they found this place. And they started making this shit. Good God. Under the sign of Ranu in the fourth rise at the eighth calling, Iathar make this record. As Tamaku directs, I've compared the most ancient of our records of the Empress's malady with the newly taken samples. In the latest samples, Tamaku was correct. The nutritive flow to both organs of generativity were intact, albeit reduced, and therefore they would have been functional before the spinal repair. However, since the influx of Vitae, the organs are now entirely withered. Why has the substance not reconstructed them? Did the degenerative malady affect them permanently before the treatment began? I have asked whether I should prepare a report for the Empress, but Tamaku informs me that this is unnecessary. It is, of course, merely of al uh, alchemical interest and no matter for concern, for she is eternal in her name. Yeah, if she's eternal, we're going to find out if she's actually et uh, eternal or not. Huh. I wonder if I can make it bounce over that thing instead. I think it's T to rotate. That didn't fucking help. Why? Oh, there we go. That works. Let me clear out the rest of this room first, though. Oh, look, an orb thingy. I find myself again confined. Yeah. A day should not matter, but each day feels like waste. There is so much to do. Tamaku tells me that now, with Vitae, I have forever. But the people who depend on me do not. There is always something. Invasion, rivalry, sickness, penury. I have my duty. Perhaps I should end these sessions. Now they've found a way to stabilize the disease. I should be ecstatic. I should accept my fate and move on. It is such a faint hope that they can find any way to heal me. That they can find any way to grant my dearest wish. Now you are eternal, says Tamaku. Now you need no heir. None of them understand. This is not about politics or securing a future. This is not for the Empire. This is for me. Just for me. I think that's fair. Translate. Iliander Septark of the Ekindled Fortress has dispatched messengers to the Outer Isles under the guise of a trade mission, despite our previous warning. It is my recommendation that we relocate three-fifths of the 2nd Regiment to the Isles immediately. On the matter of the harvested stock, it has been suggested that with the new chamber development, the need for such stock will diminish. I believe that it is short-sighted. This new capacity surely means that we are at liberty to increase the number of factories. With that, we can vastly increase our defense capability as well as increase standards of living across the Empire. This new expertise is a gift. We would be wise to make use of it. Instruct me, Great Empress, and I will inform the Council of your decision. In your name, Eternal. Christ. 
This fucking chair's all about. Ooh. Hello? It's not able. This one must be broken. <laughs> this one too, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Wild. Can I go in here? Nope. All right. It's a cool looking bed. Ow. It's, it's a little things. All right, cool. Now I can open this door since it has power. The hello. What noise was that? Nope, go back. I don't want to. Nope, I don't want to touch any of that. Thank you. I don't know what the fuck that is. There's no literature anywhere on this? Come on now. God damn it. You're gonna just put just take the put it in your pocket? Like what the fuck's going on here? <laughs> oh that's the amulet. Okay. Under the sign of Edu on the first rise at the eighth calling I Kita make this record. The configuration of the new test gate has been delayed by a failure in a subsidiary node. Mihara, you must complete it on the next rise as you have been prepared. Place the orb in the center, select the focusing symbols for this alignment. And insert two full cells of uh, Vitae. Remember Tamaku's lessons, Mihara. Master the orb. It is your focus and discipline that will open the portal, allow objects to be sent through. Oh, okay. Oh, I got it. Okay. Excuse you. There we go. I'll check this one out first, I guess. What the fuck? Yeah, this is something else. <laughs> you must be her. This locked? I think it is. What if I just wait? Well, hold on. What's this thing over here? What's this? All right. There was a white sun at the great gate. It tore the air and the land. A corruption of living flesh crawls from the hole in the world and turns all to ash and rust. The control stones have turned against my kindred, shaping them into floating wraiths of nightmare. The city falls. I am to blame. Yeah, bastard. 
My companions took my formula, some to use it to destroy the Vitae at the gate, others to infect the Vitae pipelines and end the suffering. The gate has indeed fallen, but catastrophically, unleashing energies beyond belief. Still the factories scream. We have failed in the worst of ways. It is my duty to stay at my post, to see if I can find means to end it. I have no choice but to use the Vitae. An ocean holds the great empress to life, so a meager portion will suffice for me. If any find this record, know that I was the traitor Kita. Alchemist, apprentice to Tamaku. Forgive us our folly. Here, it looks like you fucked up. Right, I guess I'll just end your suffering. I'm sorry, but... I think you just prefer that at this point. saw that, right? Tamaku's early experiments with the orbs summoned an entity, a creature, that scarred the world with its passing and wreaked utter destruction. The scar took the form of living, pulsating flesh. I have studied the orb, and I now know why the scars appear. I believe I can make use of the same perturbation to achieve our own ends. I, I, I. Another one. It has taken me many, many rises in the gaps between my work for Tamaku, but finally it is done. I have a formula which is in sympathy with the pulse of the orb. I can provoke the symptoms of the red flesh, and with it will come destruction, channeled through the Vitae network. This might be the answer we seek. By the looks of it, it was not. <laughs> Right, moving forward. Oh, fuck. I don't have, uh... There's no power on this one. I don't think I can get it to... I might be able to. Oh, look below us. Yep, hold on. Come on, dude. Really? Asshole. Maybe I can bring it back in here. And that'll make it work. Like, why can't we use that? What the fuck?
Fine, the fuck with you then. I do. I think I could take it back at some point. I don't know what these symbols mean. Oh, what zap over there? Is that the point? Oh, look at the top. They're right there. So it's like a. Uh, a circle with a little E thing on it at the top. Oh, it's this guy right there. But it needs to be the first one, which is there. And it needs to have, like, this guy sitting down holding his arms up. Just like this. <laughs> Fuck! Thank you for the anonymous door slam. Thank you, demon, for the lurk, my dude. So hold on. There's another one of those, but doesn't look right. Oh, right here? And what's that last one? Looks like one of those M's with the circle. Yeah, it's right there. That looks right. What am I missing here? That didn't do it. Oh, shit. Okay. Some other button has to get hit here somewhere. That's the right three things. Yep. Yeah, this is definitely right. Oh! God damn it. That's that. No. A tower. Smoke. That's the town. And the doctor. But how can that be? How can't it? Something just changed the air it's foul great i have no idea where we are i'm glad you're here though i 
Hello? Oh, fuck! Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. What just happened? Hello, can I? What the fuck? I can't use any lighting things. Am I tripping on just absolute tripping balls here? What's going on? Oh fuck. How do I get there? I can't jump. I can't go backwards here. Oh, this way, okay. Uh, what are you doing, little one? One and one. <laughs> yes, but what is one and one? Alice? Alice can't play. Alice can't play. Alice is gone. Don't worry, Mama. I'm here. Jesus. What the fuck? Oh, fuck. I don't know where to go. Everything is falling apart in the womb. Ah. God, the blinding light. There we go. Alice? Alice! Sell him! Sell him quickly! Yikes. It's quite the dream I had. Um... No. No, 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 no. You're so much bigger. This can't be real. Wake up. Wake up, Tessie. Oh, God. Oh, God, Mother Mary. What am I going to do? Why? <laughs> well... Come on. Come on. Pull yourself... Together. <sighs> Sorry, I ran away to shower. No worries. Where are we? <sighs> uh, Skyrim, probably now. I, I'd assume some droggers are gonna come out. <sighs> Shit! I'm I'm so heavy. This feels like six months more. God. Oh, there must have been me that did that. Oh, shit. This isn't a dream. This really isn't a dream.
Ah, okay. I do have to go this way. happened there oh boy fuck let's get this shit out of me Those things just aren't working anymore. Oh, that smell. Like, uh, like back in the laboratory. It's getting stronger. I don't know where to go. Oh, look, that ladder. Is that the way out? Uh oh. That for sure. What the fuck was the point of that? Random. Thank you, Tree Beard, for the uh, the biddies. A chase scene. Shit. Oh, God. Fucking come on. God damn it. I can't speed crawl here. Fuck. I have to move these boards, don't I? Yep. <laughs> that was a fun chase.
<clears throat> so they brought her to the doctors, checking her heartbeat. Okay. Got here a wheel I'm assuming I'm doing the right thing here I can't move that at all that's easy I also can't move that. Okay. That makes that part pretty simple. Ah. It's the town again, little one. See? It's another gateway, I think. A portal. Yep, we I fell through one of these. Him, but big enough for us. Look, little one. I think this is a way out of here. And no it's Welcome in, friend. Is it working? Fuck, I bet you this opens up with this. Isn't working. Probably just one of those power core things. How's it going, pal? Hey, it's going. Just vibing, playing some amnesia rebirth. Alright, so I need something somewhere. I'm assuming I did the right thing here based on how I lined that up. That's where we started. Oh, here we go. Oh. What are you up to this evening, Sass? Anything good? Observations. Hey, Leyden Jar. Like vessel resembling those in place and device in portal chamber, but spent, broken. Relic age unknown. Manufacturing quality high, as if welded or cast using advanced modern industrial methods. Spiral symbol on Leyden Jar Bank, also found on door near camp, leading to maze grid chambers below. Devices powered by electric fluid or some means of gathering electric fluid. Nothing much, just eating a late dinner and relaxing. Nice! What's on the grub menu for tonight? I guess we'll check down here first. Oh, great. Yo, dicks! There were people here? Grill some ribeye steaks with asparagus and red potatoes? Oh my god! So you gonna fucking share it, or what? Sounds fantastic. Professor, I believe this is only one part of a bigger construction. The archives make reference to this place as a gate, but it also talks of other gates. If I'm reading correctly, and there's a symbol that I read as crops or harvest? <laughs> Excuse me. Perhaps it's related to the seed. <clears throat> 17th May, 1839. I was right as a bitter pill. A mithraeum and in an or and in it an orb and now my dolt of an assistant has shattered it. I have sent it and him to Brennenberg. Perhaps something may be salvaged. So what is left to me now? There's a gate here. I have a vitae, but I have no orb, and have discovered nothing of what Brennenberg called the Traveler's Locket. Yet it is clear this place is part of something greater. These halls are not the final resting place of their great queen. Whatever the legends may say, this Amelia spoke on a wheel. What does the hub hold? Well, 
I know where she was chilling, and uh, she dead. Ribeye's my all-time favorite steak. For me, I'd say either that or a porterhouse. Both, though. Mm. Delicious. Ooh, what we got here? Nice. That's what we like to see. God damn it, tree. The fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Abdullah. Kaylin will take on Daniel's duties. You are to commence excavation of the side tunnels immediately. Break down the Roman walls if you must. They are irrelevant. Anything older than Roman, investigate. If there are any more markings such as are in the room with the cage, I wish to hear about them. Any records, carvings, or signs that resemble an amulet or bracelet, I wish to hear about them. Any round stone of crystal, do not touch it on pain of death, but summon me at once. <laughs> In Porterhouse. I also really like the Demonico stakes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was playing Clone Hero earlier and played Crumbling Castles. I would have paid any amount of money to hear you sing that part. <laughs> Crumbling Castles. Crumbling, crumbling castles. Such a good fucking song. What the fuck is this? Toggle text, please. Ethereal resonance chamber. Tuning? Ethereal flow selector. Portal chamber. Orb pedestal and shielding. Focus control. Laden jars. Energy store. Yo, this whole fucking thing is insane. And what's this? Ah, I see. The caves in the middle there. Were like, well, the little tents are. <sighs> Here's where I am. Going back, it gives you to the orb, and there's another side door I can take to go do the pencils, which looks like it's the thing up top, which is the ethereal resonance chamber. I cook three and a half minutes on each side and get a perfect medium rare steak. There you go. It's a banger. I've never tried a demonico steak. I'll have to try it. Yeah, they're, they're solid. Oh, I didn't read this note. Did I? Maybe I did. Oh, no, okay. Caleb, a full and accurate copy of the symbols in the room with the pillars is most important. Devote yourself to it. I wish it to be completed by the time I rise tomorrow. In particular, pay attention to the symbol I have labeled as seed. I believe it to be the crystal orb that I seek. A clue to its whereabouts will see you well rewarded. Bitch, I got the orb. You ain't got shit. Right, before I head back that way, what's in here? Ah. Damn it. Alright, not much else I could do in here. But that is definitely a place that I would put up one of those power sources. If I had one! Oh, wait. What's over here? Really? Whole thing was just a farce. Son of a bitch. It's like a really thick cut extra marbled ribeye steak. To, you would love it. On a marbled ribeye? Oh yes, I would love it. Thanks for the heads up. Hell yeah. Alright. There should be another room here. It's fucking creepy. Over here to the left, I believe. Ah! Yes. Oof. 
I already have 10 fucking matches, so... Bitch. I can't take anymore. Huh. So I'm just gonna oh, well, we drill over stakes in the chat. <laughs> of course, I'm going along with it. Oh, my heart. Aha! Uh -huh. The giant crayon things. Nice. Alright. So we gotta find... Yeah, more legislature. Diagram a wall of map. Ley line, star chart. Position on radio spectrum. Akin to wavelength. Must test complete paths. Sure. No, I just realized how many spins you have to do. Well, I yeah. At least they can't be found. I did one earlier and it was the fucking the death nut. Unless we can get out of here. Perhaps there's once a real person called Tin Hinan, a leader for people. If so, she's likely buried in the Tuareg tomb far above us. There are other much older stories that have been conflated with hers. Legends of the Grey Lady, a goddess who walks the desert. Legends of a healer, legends of an empress. I think these are ancient memories of what truly happened in this place. Yikes. Damn, it's the nut again. You're always missing that nut, sass. You have to be, you know, on top of that nut. The fuck? So... I don't know what symbols I'm supposed to use yet. It hasn't necessarily stated either what that dude's dead. And I don't think there's any symbols downstairs from what I remember. Okay. So maybe there's something else somewhere that I can figure out what to tune this to. I mean, there's something way up there. There's also something over here. This is my answer. Alright, we'll head up the other way up the scaffolding then that's so conveniently placed here. Aha, uh -huh, okay. So I can't climb it like that. Is there another entry point for this? Maybe. Yeah, we getting tired running around like this. Oh my god. How am I supposed to get up the scaffolding? There's no fucking ladder. There's a ladder there. Garbo. Fuck. Alright. Um. I probably can't go up here, huh? Or are we blocked off? Yeah, it's blocked. Hmm. 
Interesting. Ooh. This place is so strange. Who on earth built it, do you think? Huh? Who on earth? <laughs> I don't I don't think we're there. It's like some fucking Stargate shit. Alright. So I'm not too certain which one we're supposed to be using here. Oh wait, it's already set, isn't it? It's already set where we want to go, so... Oh wait, it's also not set properly. Um, winky face... Arms up in praise. Come on. Winky face, arms up in praise. It's only right there, but that's not right. Winky face. I think we're missing some tiles or something here. If I slid into your DMs with my fattest fuck stoner meal, will you live react? Maybe. What is it? What the fuck? So none of this moves? That can't be right. Like, those pieces don't fucking fall right there. I can't rotate them anywhere. Hogwash. Three quarter pound cheeseburgers, Bosco sticks, and baked beans. Hold, please. This is a stoner meal. Jesus Christ, heavy. <laughs> Damn. Them burgs looking good. Got some beans. I don't know. I've never had a uh I've never had a Bosco stick before. Those look good though. Looks like some type of um like I don't want to say pastry, but some type of cylindrical bun with some goodness in there, I'm sure. Of the fourth burger for Jenna, it's just a super stuffed cheese bread. Oh, nice. Okay. Fair enough. It's good shit, though. Thank you for sharing. I want to eat the fuck out of that. So, I'm confused. Maybe I do have to rotate these? So, I need to know what to set this to. So I think we have to go back down first. I just, I think. Ugh. Do, 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 do. All right, more matches I don't need. All right, so we're here. Oh, so is the baby. We're going to French Sudan, to a gold mine, to make it more efficient. Alex Darling's family will pay. 
I was doing some drawings. Jonathan. Poor Jonathan. He was the engineer. And what choose is gold. Made all of this. Fucking nothing. That's where I want to go. What are the symbols do I need? What symbols do I need? Oh, is this door open? I can't remember if I even checked it. It's fucking locked. Son of a fuck. It's time for me to hit the pillow. Thanks for the stream. Have a great night. Bye, chat. Take this uh, NYC game. Appreciate you. Hopefully you get that motherboard in soon. Your PC's back and running soon. Thank you so much for dropping in. Appreciate you. Son of a fuck indeed. Guys, I don't know. I'm supposed to be using three symbols and it ain't showing me no fucking symbols. Cause ain't nothing upstairs, it's a fence tree and a door. So this has enough power because I can see the power coming out there. Fuck. Let me go check outside again. Penis. I can't go up this scaffold, can I? No. around here unless of course this is uh I was hoping there'd be symbols on it but I don't really see any symbols on those things up there they're just kind of really quickly etched or sketched and that's how we get upstairs to that I figured out the focus control already Orbin pedal still in shielding is down there Leiden jars energy store where is that An addition, and then ethereal flow selector. I have no idea if I've even found that yet. But none of that's really helpful. I still don't even know what fucking symbols I'm supposed to be using. And this won't have any symbols in it. I'm pause. Yeah, there's some storage there for power shit. These doors don't open. And those aren't the symbols that are inside that I can even use. Uh...
I'm not a big fan of when there's something obvious missing in a puzzle. And I'm just not picking it up anywhere. <gasps> Excuse me. That's where we came from. I'm gonna head back up to the other room and get a better look at some things. And I'm doing a good job of not looking anything up for this game. But... I think it's possible I may have met my match here. That tattered fucking cloth scared me. God damn it. You didn't do that before. Okay. So those two look right. And honestly, all three do. Can't do anything about it, so this shit, I bet. Okay. There's a multitude of ones I can use here. Okay. And what about this one? Not that this one in the middle is not right, that's for sure, because this just kind of goes and stops. We're back to this one again. Alright, I think that's right. Because they like lit up and we're all happy. Alright, so now we need a winky face and then two cows, I think that is. Winky face, two cows this way. Oh, 
Let's go, baby. Well, I guess that's worked. I'd say so. Let's hope that's fixed the portal. Go fucking check it out. Oh yeah, let's touch the baby. Touch the baby. Hello. Hello, little one. It's good to know I'm not alone. You should have a name. Selim and I, we... We never talked about it. His mother was Amara. So you shall be Amari. That works for a boy or a girl. Amari. <laughs> Hello, little Amari. All right, little Amari. We need to go get to the goddamn gateway portal. Look at that. Figured out that puzzle. Just had to take another look. Not far now, we'll soon be home. All right, baby, let's go. Oh, hold up. Let's go. No, there's definitely something wrong here. Yeah, we're still shy of power. Let's see if this unlocks now, mysteriously. Why is this one not turned in properly? Maybe that'll do it? Yep. My orb back, please. Sir, my orb. Wait, maybe if I put that thing back in there. Okay, and we should be able to go, because that symbol that's on there looks like the symbol that's over by this door over here. Headed to bed, pretty sure I've got what Mr. Disconnected has. Ugh, that sucks. I hope you feel better, my dude. I'm so sorry you're not feeling too hot and it was a rough day. Hopefully tomorrow is a better day. Yeah, I'll talk to you tomorrow either way. Just making sure you're all right, little Amari. Little Amari. Here we go. Hell yeah, brother. Are you ready? 
He's the one. Crying at a birthday party. What is this madness? Still throwing down in CL tomorrow. Oh, uh, clone hero. Yes, I um, I should be able to join a little bit later on, I believe. What in the fuck is this? Yo, it's an egg chair. TAH, we cannot reach the device. Attempts to break the metal have failed, as it is of the same strange composition as the Leyden jars. A thorough analysis is impossible until we can get closer, but my theory is that the Leyden jars are contained for some form of energetic etheric fluid, and that the device in the room below is some means of gathering such fluid to fill those jars. What exactly is drawn from is unclear, showing not simply the surrounding atmosphere. It would require something with a great deal more vitality. I've sent the boy Rashid below with the paint pot and brush and told him to mark any route he finds. Clearly. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. Under the sign of the seven on the third rise at the second calling, I, Karangi, make this record. The harvesters have adapted to the refinements to the hunting ground. Over the last ten rises, I mark a full yield of 17 cells, which is an improvement of four cells over the previous cycle. Mareku suggests that the new transfiguration batch may be a contributor. I advise a cycle with prior harvester stock to eliminate uncertainty. Uh. So recorded in her name eternal. Okay. Fuck that. What the fuck? Fuck that too. Go figure. Oh, that's interesting. I wonder if that's power oriented. Oh, yeah, the arrows. Hold on. I don't know what's happened to me. The darkness. 
Blocked on the other side, I think. The fuck is that? Who's casting fucking spells on me like that? That ain't fucking cool. Oh, I can't reach it. Nice. Oh, shit. Alex. Alex Sterling. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. I'm so sorry. Go. Follow her. Save Hank. I'm going after Richard. Best of luck, Tarzi. Yeah, he didn't have any really good luck with that, now did he? Locks the door. Interesting. I feel a bit better in here, little Emily. Just you rest. Alex, darling. He and Richard were in love. I knew when I first saw him. Sitting beneath the trees in the hotel garden. With Richard complaining about the coffee. It was in every look they shared. Huh. Under the sign of Oranga on the second rise of the second calling, I had Karangi make this record. We've identified a fault in the revised layout for the hunting ground gating system, where previously the harvesters had leeway to stock the subjects for at least 100 Idar. The current configuration lowers that to 30, as the subjects simply panic and stampede. This does not give enough time for an appropriate buildup of harvestable energy within their systems. I recommend restoring the previous configuration temporarily while we reevaluate. So recorded in her name, Eternal. No one's broken. Uh, hello? Fuck. Come on.
Ooh. I can't get up. I don't know where to go. I have nowhere to go. Knows my fucking name. How? How can you live? How the fuck do I get out of here? Fuck. Damn. You know what? I think it requires this. No? Wow. What the fuck, dude? How did that work? I fucking hate this. Fuck. Oh, God, this is tough. Lost the world in the bright light. 
fuck. Fuck that. No way out. I'll wait for you. I can wait. How much time do you have? Party. Fuck you, dude. Holy fuck. Leon. That thing was Leon. That's fucked. Oh, it used to belong to my father. He always said he brought him good luck. I think you've done pretty well for me so far, eh? You're, uh, Anastasi, right? I'm Leon de Vries. I'm planning this big future. Desi. And this is Salim, my husband. Right. Right. I see. Attempts to open the portal unleash uncontrolled bursts of energy, and the shadow wakes and gathers. Fractures dance on the edges of the soft places, breaking through from there to here. Something terrible has happened. I am abandoned. Over time, the energy levels must fall, but how long will it take? What has happened on the other side? Why do they not answer me? Hmm. God, I really hope I don't have to go back to that fucking maze. that what the f I have to swing on a different objects At least I'm not getting hurt in here. Come on. I guess I missed that hint. Where's the, uh... Not that. Huh. There was some way to swing on stuff, and I completely missed the, uh, the concept. So I was too busy doing something else. 
Fuck. Move, damn you. Oh wait, I can go into here, right? Oh yeah. There we go. That's something. Is it a ladder? Okay. Interesting. Be fucking appearing and disappearing in here. What the fuck? Whoops. Let's go this way now. I hope this isn't giving you nightmares, little one. Oh, this is what we're worried about? You just need to be careful. How's that for careful? Oh, sick. This must be the storage room. Yeah. What the hell is it? It's making my teeth ache. Oh, I see. They they made me say anything. Everything. Oh, not gonna talk to you. Energy in this. Not enough, I guess. Oh, it will not pull down. Okay. I won't back down. Was there a button? All right, so maybe I have to show up with another one and it'll just magically be able to work. Oh God. Oh, 
I was supposed to lock him in here. Would he go back in? Nice. All right. All right. I'm in. I'm in the. We got it. We got it. Please let the fuck go faster. Oh my god. here. You fuck that dude up. Oh, In defense, Richard was kind of being an idiot. Richard was being a Richard. It's full of life now. Richard's life. I should take this back upstairs. To the machine. Hell yeah. <sighs> Can't remember where you are for TW. Oh God. God, little one. What's TW? The machine. Did, did it hurt you? Did I hurt you? Shit. Shit. <sighs> Oh, I yeah, I'm not too sure. I know what's happening to me. Yo, baloney boy. BB cakes up on the bitch. What's up, dude? Excuse me, Paul. But Paul, you know where the you know where the power box is? Right? Oh, yeah, right. Good old right boom man. Here. Okay, yeah, he's coming across to you guys. He's got a from what side? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ah. Over there. <laughs> There's the answer. Oh my goodness. Hello, Laser. Hey, bo Bony Boy. How's it going, dude? How is everybody? How did uh, how'd your therapy go today in Outlast Trials? Did you get Program X unlocked yet? Excuse me. We're just playing some um, Amnesia Rebirth. Because I never played it. What? My chair would not move for a second. We tried Project Mega and it sucks. Yeah, I was reading the um, the variators in them. Like, all of them, we have to be close to everybody. You get damage. And then the last three, I think, in Project Omega, um, rigs don't work at all. Like, you just, they're not allowed. You can't, you, like, don't bring them with you. Which is fucking absurd, if you ask me. <laughs> Cheers, bud. More than five minutes? <laughs> oh, man. That sucks. <laughs> Cheers to you, laser. Oh. So yeah, I really want to play the bunker, but I need to get this done first. And I feel like we're getting close to the end, but I'm not too sure. BB, we need to play together. Uh-oh. What's going on here? VR Devour. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Get up the stairs. There we go. That's only borderline creepy. to bed have a great stream my dude and have a great night everyone yo thanks man appreciate the raid hope you have a lovely evening i hope you have a good friday tomorrow sorry this game is super loud right now too How the fuck am i gonna get back I guess I can use this to, like, the current is against me, like, pulling me in. I'll just stand behind it back here. The other one's the other way. I don't think that's better. Yeah, this looks better. All right, fuck it. I'm confused. Where do I go?
All right, so there really isn't that bad of a car in. Let me try it on, see if I can swing this thing. I wanna see if I can swing that thing into the engines and fuck it up. So we'll raise that one up, yep. Yeah. I'm like, that door's fucking closed, so getting up there is going to be worthless. Only other way to go is here. Oh, fuck! Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck yourself, Leon. I'm not who I should be? Yeah, no kidding. No, I'm leaving you. You're fucking done. You're dead to me. Oh, that's why that's the... I'm just slowing you down. What did I say about self-sacrificial bullshit? We're not going to give him the satisfaction. You hear me? Hank? I hear you. Hank was bleeding out, so... Don't really have a choice there. You're not fucking sorry. I know. I know, little one. It's all right. He won't bother us. Not now. Let's get out of here. Can I get a fucking fire started in here, please? Oh, here we Don't go. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. He's behind us now. He doesn't matter. We just need to get this canister into the machine upstairs. Then we can leave. I think, yes. Is this an elevator? Oh, it's a ladder. Very nice. A bit further. Christ. Come on. Oh, that was not easy. All right, take a break. Look for some more shit here. Alright, that should be everything. Alright. Another flight, here we come. Oh. Going that way. We're safe. We are away from him now. We met yeah, this is good tonight, bitch. Dolly. Good good morning. Very early good morning to you. Thank you for the biddies. How you be doing? How are things? But I can't really remember.
That dude got fucked up. Oh, right! Five thirty AM oof. Go back to bed. <laughs> Here's this big maze again. Yeah, we've been here before oh shit. Okay, alright, alright. I hear you, baby. Some sort of deal with the ghost. Hank was hurt. Oh, I wish I could remember. Right, let's see. I had to go back this way. Where I came in here and I broke that piece of wood. So we're slowly just backtracking from where we came from. Yes. This way. Nice. Okay. Been asleep since 10 p.m. last night. Uh, seven and a half hours? That's pretty good. One. One, my dearest. To the portal. I need the other canister that I used for the door. Thank you. Appreciate you telling me that. And you rang. Okay, good. Oh, fuck. Leave me the fuck alone! Oh, fuck! God damn it. Every time we get so fucking close. Oh, fuck! This bitch. What do you want? Doesn't even say anything and just fucking flies away. Thanks, you know. Are you there, little one? I hope you're all right. I need to. I need to find another way back to the portal. Uh, I have no idea what we did to deserve all this bullshit. Ah. Uh. I'm not actually going. Oh, this is in the way. Oh, that was a bad idea. Oh, excuse me. Hmm. Fuck, dude. I just want to. I just want to leave. Oh, okay. We've been this way before. This looks familiar. A little bit, at least. <laughs> What do you see? 
It's dark, Mama. It's so dark. She went blind? That's sad. I'm not sure about this little model. She led us this way. I just hope there's another way back to the portal through here. Yeah, because I'm going to spend all that time fucking setting it up. I'd like to use it. Thanks. God. Oh. All right, let's chill out here. These are the seven rulers of Ornaya's bloodline. Ornaya the Binder, First Empress. Eren Seastar, Spear of the Isles. Takemira of the Singing Vines. Taranga the Builder. Marai Stoneheart, Blessed Atua of the Golden Hand. Tihana, who is last and eternal. Jesus. Okay. Oh, there we go. It's a fucking joke. <sighs> Great. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Fuck! Bro, let me. Hello? Just wait, wait, please! Come on! Alright, so I need to, like, run across or something after I do that. Leon. We're not doing too hot. <laughs> Maybe we're not supposed to get through that. How did I fucking get in here?
Oh. All right. Made it past that time. Don't worry about that. Fuck you. Ooh. It's a little safe for my guess. Keeper lived here. Not those creatures, but actual people. They slept in beds. Laughed. Loved. It's comforting somehow. What is chittering over here? Okay. So that might not be the right way to go. The problem is, is it's the only way to go. Oh boy. All right, so we're going to be very quiet. They appear to be sleeping.
There's no fucking lock. We're going for a nice little crawl through here. I was beating the shit out of his ball bag. Yeah, basically. What's this? Full of fucking monsters. Everywhere. Scraping through the roots. Stuffing. Hunting. <clears throat> Try not to lose them. Try not to lose them, but I'm so fucking scared of them. Of me. Too scared. I keep blacking out. Waking up where I shouldn't be. I don't remember where. I'm so angry. I was gnawing on a fucking bone when I wake up. A fucking bone. Leon. It's, it's Leon. Remember. Mm. No, you're not Leon. You're, uh, you're all gone. Well, that's probably the correct way to go, but what's this way? Nope, fuck that. We're gonna go the other way. <laughs> Jesus. Leon, my guy. <clears throat> Little aggressive. <gasps> well, thanks for the assistance, I guess. We're not, we're not safe. Oh, God. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, fuck! Stay out, dickhead! Come on, dickhead. Fuck, he's fast. Why do I spin around in a fucking circle like that? I hate that. I should have to go this way for something. Right here. I didn't see it before.
We're gonna open that up. Excuse me. Yeah, thanks for the hint, I know. Good, I get some more juice in the lantern. Well, that's not fucking good. Can we maybe just need to be quiet? Fucking. This puzzle's annoying. It won't let me grab it. Got it. I was so boned. Shit. Run. Oh, fuck. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Wait, seriously, I'm safe here? I don't think I'm really safe there. They gave me enough time to grab shit. shit, shit. Fuck that. Oh, fuck that. Ah. Just keep going. Just keep going. Don't give up. Don't give up. Don't give up. Oh, God. Oh, shit. There maybe is another doctor in London. No. No, I will not put her through it. Not again. Hi, Tater. <clears throat> Tater, stop. Where do I put this fucking thing? Just oh, right here. Just got to get this thing. Close up, close up, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go.
Come on, baby. Please. Why won't you fucking work? What did I miss? Oh god, it's these things. They reset. They fucking reset on me. What the fuck, dude? No, no, go back. Fuck. Why did it do that? No, come on. One more. No fucking way. Now are these foxes here too? Come on, rotate, 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 rotate. Go, go. For fuck's sakes, hit the button. Hit the button. It worked! I think. Did I make it? That's sad. White light. No, 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 no. Fuck. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Whatever that flesh was, I think it broke the portal. Oh, so much for the dark. Where the hell have I taken us now? Oh. Another portal. Fuck. Damn it, I thought we were at the end of the game. I was all excited. Uh, well. Uh. Excuse me. It is uh, past one in the morning. <clears throat> I think we're at a good place to stop, at least for right now. So uh, I think we're going to take that chance and I'm going to wrap this shit up. Anyways, uh, having lots of fun playing this game. This story is fucking wild, uh, but very much so enjoying it. And uh, looks like we'll be. Uh... Oh, thank you, ladies. Thank you, Twy. So, my understanding is we'll probably need a little bit more time um, on Saturday to finish Rebirth, and then we'll just go right into the bunker after that. At least that's the idea. All right, let's see who's on. One more spin for fun? No. I'm going to It's 1 in the morning, you dickhead. <laughs> Give me one second. I'm taking a look around to see who's on. Um 
You know what? Knox rated him last night. I think I'm going to rate him tonight because he's a good friend of ours trying to get affiliate here on Twitch. Uh, that's Ginger Central, of course. He's playing Kingdom Hearts. Uh, well, the, the name is fantastic. Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 and 2.5 Remix. I don't really know what that means. All I know is that it's Kingdom Hearts. That's the one thing I understand. So why don't we, uh, why don't we read our good buddy Ginger? Uh, drop him a follow if you haven't yet. He just broke the 50 fault. Really? Now you come in here? <laughs> We're about to leave. <laughs> uh, Ginger just broke 50 followers uh, last night, which is required for uh, affiliate. And now he just has to hit the uh, uh, amount of streams, the hours of streaming, and then obviously the uh, the three viewer average. So uh, if you want to come hang out, I think it'd be super cool if you could. Come help uh, get this guy to affiliate. Let me just find the... Uh... Where is he? Oh, there he is. All right, let me kick off this raid. We're going to get going. Tonight was awesome. I really enjoy... Um, really enjoying this game a lot. Um, it's, better, it's way better than the second Amnesia game. Uh, so coming across your screen now, you will find all of our... Lovely raid messages. If you'd like to partake in the raid and do that, <clears throat> you could grab the one for subscribers or for anyone else is also on there with a uh, generic emote. If you're into following on the other platforms, I'm on YouTube, VODs. Thanks, Twy. Mm. Last sip of water. Uh, so... YouTube, we have VODs and shorts on there. TikToks, you got the TikToks. Nothing crazy there. You know what's going on. Well, it is crazy. You should be there, but nothing out of the ordinary uh, of what you expect on TikTok. Twitter, I make announcements and updates there pretty regularly and share some other things and have some interesting conversations with other streamers. And uh, Discord's where all the fun goes down after streams or in between streams. So please join us there if you haven't. <laughs> have a good night, puppy <laughs> Chug loves Knox. Oh, boy. Great. All right. I'm out of here. All of you have a lovely evening, and I'll catch you Saturday. Bye.